Databricks loves IDEs. Our official VS Code extension is the first of many releases to deliver a first-class IDE experience for developers to build on Databricks. With this extension, you can run your code on Databricks without leaving the comfort of VS Code. To get started, we'll show how easy it is to run code on Databricks from VS Code and show the output in your IDE. All we have to do is select Run File on Databricks from the dropdown. The code will be sent over to your Databricks workspace and you'll see the results return to your console. It's really that easy to get started. To dig in a little deeper, let's say that we have a notebook that we want to apply software engineering best practices to within VS Code. First, we'll create a Git repo and set up an open project as you see here. We've also split the notebook into individual Python files within this directory and use VS Code to refactor our code to make it easier to maintain. You'll see that we can still use IDE functions like autocomplete and go to definition to jump around quickly, as well as integrate our unit testing framework to make sure that our code changes work as intended. Let's go ahead and run these unit tests. Oh no, one failed. It looks like the function wasn't written correctly, but fortunately, with Copilot enabled, we get a suggested line of code that looks like it should fix our problem. Let's go ahead and rerun our unit tests now, and success. The only thing left to do now that our code is refactored, tested, and ready to deploy is send it off to Databricks so we can leverage all of the scale and performance of the lake house without leaving the comfort of VS Code. All we have to do is hit run, and this executes on our Databricks cluster and spits back our results without any context switching. Start improving your development flow today by downloading the Databricks extension for VS Code, available directly from the marketplace.